Yo, Jason here. I just wanted to tell y'all a little bit about this. Uh, all right, when you're when you're actually mixing, like you you got your good mix and and you're ready to master. Like something I do here is um like I'll click on on the master bus. Like I'll click on um the on Reaper the eleven seventy five compressor and then um just just barely use it very sparingly and um it it sounds really good. Like <laughs> completely different thing dude like all right so always you know once you have like 60 70 80 tracks you know what i mean things start getting a little a little a little out of control a little clippy and stuff so what I do before I send it to the master, like this is the final mix. This is the final mixes that's going to the mastering process. So like I'll click on the a limiter uh, on Reaper. It's the re limit, but like I I, I use it very sparingly. Like you can see, like it's just barely barely clipping, barely barely clipping. So I don't really use lose any volume or any gain, and uh, it's working pretty good. But yeah, man, I just I wanted to show y'all that. Uh, little trick that i learned recently that's making the record sound good the 1175 compressor is a really fast compressor like so so as soon as the music is like boom 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 so you want to use it very sparingly but yeah that's all i got to say about this uh so much love jason